In this video, I would like to explain how to draw the state diagram of a sequence detector using Mealy FSM, finite state machine, with non-overlapping method. In this, the sequence detector is used to detect the sequence of bits in the given input data. To understand this concept, let us take an example. If the given inputs data is having group of bits, identify the number of bits 1011 to be detected in the given input data, starting from MSB 1011. One, one. These are the bits to be detected using sequence detector. Similarly, 1011. This is another group. After identify the sequence of bits in the given input data, we should write the output. The output should be one only after completion of detection of four bits. So at the last position of the group, the output should be one. Similarly, for the second group, at the last position bit, the output should be one. The remaining all bits in the output sequence should be zero. This is the functioning of the sequence detector. It should be explained more using the state diagram. To draw the state diagram, the number of states re required, identify the number of states required, which is equal to the number of bits to be detected. The number of bits to be detected, which are given in the given data, 1011, there are four bits, so that the number of states required equal to four. Let them labeled as A, B, C, D. Now, position, the number of states A, B, C, D in a proper sequence manner from left to right. The leftmost state A always considered as a reset state, also called as initial state. Now, link four states from A to D in a sequential manner. Now, place the number of bits to be detected between the states on the lines. Here, the first bit in the sequence is 1. 1 should be placed between A and B by 0. 0 means this is the output. Here already I have specified the ratio is indicated with x by z. x is input, z is output. x means single variable x means one variable, z also one variable. With one variable, we can check two possibilities, either zero or one. For single variable, we can assign two binary bits, two bits, it is zero or one. So here, first place the one by zero, zero by because of at the initial state, the output is 0 because the output should be 1 only after completion of 4 bits are detected. So that here between A and B, the output should be 0. Similarly, next place the second bit 0 between B and C. 0 numerator is the x value input. Denominator z is again 0 because only 2 bits are taken. Only 2 bits are detected. Again, between C and D, you place third bit 1, numerator x value, denominator z value. Again, z is 0 because only three bits are detected. Later, we have to check the other combinations. Now, let us start the process of drawing the state diagram. Here, for the, for the other combinations, A to B, when x equal to 1, A to B means A, A is, assume A is the present state, it goes to B state b is the next state when x equal to 1 and z equal to 0. This is 
for mele machine this is the way to draw the mele machine mele machine means the next state depends on the next state depends on previous state depends on previous state input and also output and also output so the next state depends on the value of a initially the state diagram starts from a this is the present state this present state goes to next state when input x equal to 1 and z equal to 0 now we have to find for x equal to 0 also because x is the variable single variable so the variable itself is having two bits here only one bit is detected we have to find another bit also so for x equal to 0 always it goes to reset state initially always it goes to reset state reset state means this is nothing but self state self state initially if a goes to b when x equal to 1 with z equal to 0 when this is the first case if x equal to 0 it always goes to self state or reset state when z equal to 0 why here z equal to 0 again the detection of four bits are not completed at this level next so with this present state a the two combinations are completed now let us move to state b the state b goes to c when x equal to 0 and z equal to 0 now we have to find when x equal to 1 where it moves where it moves to which state to which next state it moves for that there is an easy way to find the next state when x equal to 1 here you can easily understand this is the easy way first i have written b and x b is the present state x means already when x equal to 0 it goes to c now i have to find when x equal to 1 so for b its value is 1 input 1 for x i have to find when x equal to 1 so that under x i have written 1 now 1 1 this one means this is nothing but single state b called as single bit state b called as single bit state the name itself is single bit state now to which next state the b goes when x equal to 1 for that purpose there is an easy way just check the last two bits the last two bits x equal to 1 now you should check with the b bit single bit state 1 1 both are matched both are matched if they are matched then it goes to self state what is self state b is the present state here so that b goes to b itself that's why i have written b goes to self state when x equal to 1 with the z equal to 0 so b is completed b when x equal to 0 it goes to c when x equal to 1 it goes to self state in the same way for c c also you have to find both conditions for the the first case is when x equal to 1 c goes to d with the z equal to 0 now we have to find when x equal to 0 to which state it goes for that just i have written here in an easier way cx c means what is the c value here how can we consider the b value the input for b state is 1 the input bit for b state is 1 in the same way for c 1 0 both bits are inputs 1 0 both bits are inputs to the c that's why we called it as c nothing but two bit state the name itself is called as two bit state c called as two bit state so c equal to 1 0 c equal to 1 0 okay c equal to 1 0 now 
when x equal to 1 it goes to d now we have to find when x equal to 0 so under c i have written 0 now i have to check whether it goes to self state or to any other state so that i have written the two bit state c here 1 0 now compare the last two bits 0 0 1 0 not matched not matched means if matched go to self state if does not match then it goes to reset state so c when x equal to 0 it goes to reset state when x equal to 0 then z equal to 0 next in the same way come to d here what is the input for d 1 0 1 1 0 1 so the three bits are the inputs that's why we called it as this is the three bit state d is called as three bit state so first write the inputs of the d 101 now here d we have to check for both conditions when x equal to 0 and when x equal to 1 also first initially let us check for x equal to 0 0 here now you should compare is it goes to self state when x equal to 0. For that purpose, I have written d again here, 101. Now compare the last three bits. Again, not matched. So that when x equal to 0, it goes to reset state. Then z equal to 0. This case. Again, same repeated for d. For the last state only, we have to check both conditions. Here, dx, same, d means 101. Now, we have to check for x equal to 1. Then, check for any possibility is there to go to self-state. For that purpose, I have written D101 again under the three bits, last three bits. 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1. When I compare these three bits, again not matched. So that it goes to again reset state. But already I have drawn one line for 0 by 0 case. No need to draw another line. You can draw or may not be drawn. Okay, so for this case also, when x equal to 1 also, the same reset state is the next state. So that just you should specify on the same line with comma. 0 by 0 is the first case. The second case is 1 by 1. This is x equal to 1. Why I have written z equal to 1 here? Because 1, 0, 1, the numerator itself is 1. What is our given sequence? 1, 0, 1, 1. See the numerator values. 1, 0, 1, 1. All the four bits are detected. The detection is completed. That's why z equal to 1. This is the way how to draw the state diagram of a sequence detector using Mealy finite state machine with the non-overlapping method. Thank you for watching this video. And if you like this video, please subscribe, share, and like. Thank you.